with two young boys the Daniels are used to an active household. Good boy. Usually it's a, it's loud, <laughs> kids running around. But now they are left with almost nothing, almost. He saved our dog and cat and he saved our house. That hero, eight-year-old Quentin Daniels, who was coming home from school Friday afternoon. That's when he first realized something was wrong. I opened the front door. What I saw only was a lot of smoke everywhere, like all over the place. At that moment, he says he recalled what firefighters taught him during a school visit last year. I know what to do. I need to go to the fire department and get them so they can put it out. So he started running, running the several blocks toward the fire station. I crossed the street and then like this lady picked me up and drove me the rest of the way. And once he got there, fire crews were immediately dispatched to the house. They were able to keep the fire mainly contained to the kitchen. Right here's where the fire department's saying caused the fire. Almost everything in the home has damage, but not the most important ones. What was your biggest concern? My dog. Why? Because I, mean, I was afraid that she was going to die. Molly the dog lived, and so did Charlie the cat. And now Quentin is getting the attention he didn't know he yeah. deserved. I didn't know that all this would happen just by doing that. I am so proud of him. I am. I just, yeah, it makes me want to cry. <laughs>